back. Um, I just decided to do a hair tutorial where I show you guys how I dye my natural hair. Um, I've gone back into the natural hair journey. Um, the reason is of doing of cutting my hair was because I've turned 30 on that day. So I was like, you know what? Let me just start over. So my new beginning started with cutting my hair as I'm turning into this new woman into my 30s now I'm into my leveled up into the third level now so you get to see how I dye my hair so I dyed my hair with this uh, dark and lovely product uh, the color was spicy red as you can see here I'm mixing it up now and I'm going to try and mix the step one and step two together into this bowl so this bowl you can get it at clicks and also you can get it at discount As you can see here, I started with taking out the accessories that were the accessories that were on my ears because I needed to remove them. Um, because with me, I've got a sensitive skin, so if you're having accessories on your ears and you're dying, don't forget, guys, a dye is a chemical, so I needed to remove that. So as you can see here, I'm placing a Vaseline around the perimeters of my hairline so just to protect my um, skin and also not to go over my skin so we just dyed my hair not my skin um, so yeah we need to put out the Vaseline as you can see here I am putting the, the gloves that I came with the dye <laughs> Okay, and then we're just checking it again. As you can see here, the liquid is slightly red. Not completely red, but you can see it's actually uh, forming into the color that I am dyeing my hair. Which is the spicy red. Which I love. As I've told you guys before, you might have noticed on my vlogs, um, I really don't like the color of my natural color um, so I prefer dyeing my hair so if I'm gonna be having a natural hair my hair needs to be colored I don't like my um, my natural color hair so hence I am dyeing my hair into this beautiful spicy red so I start with the perimeters of my hairline I'll go around my head as you can see here so I'm going to start from the front and then I'm going to go all the way around and then I'll go in with the glove So this part here I couldn't properly see, I was using my mirror so I needed to uh, push out my ear out of the way as you can see here. So we try to also go at the back of my hair so we try to properly dye all my hair. We don't want to have any patches so in order to have a proper thing we need to do the right thing so as you can see here. I'm on the other side of my ear. We um, lay flat the ear so we can go properly into my hair because my hairline is very close to my ears. So if a mistake happens, it will be seen. Booty, I didn't go around those lines. So plus also I've got hair 
on my neck so I always ha have to be extra careful and check that I've dyed all my hair I'll try and do a close-up as you can see that I've got hair on my neck as well as you can see I'm trying to go into the ear the hair that's on my neck so we are dying all the hair not some of the hair all of it <laughs> Okay, I think I'm going to change now here as you can see um, I think I've covered all my I've covered, covered the perimeter of my hair so now I think I'm going to change and go into the glove with my hands and not use the brush as you can see here I'll be going in with the with my hands now here <laughs> I was saying in the video um, this color red the red spicy the spicy red color um, it looks like your Kenyan um, ladies would have this color here I'll try and insert a picture of the Kenyan women when they dye their hair it's almost like sand red sand but yeah I was like Okay, we're going into the Kenyan side. <laughs> and there's a bit of ginger in there. Now that my whole head is covered with the chemical, with the dye, um, I decided to sit this out for about 30 minutes because on the pack it says apply for 30 minutes. So I did sit for 30 minutes. As you can see here, I was just trying to show you that I've covered all my hair with the chemical dye, as you can see here. So we're waiting this one part out here um, as you can see so I was like saying I'm gonna wait for 30 minutes and I'll be back okay so the 30 minutes is up so I'm gonna show you the products that I'm gonna be using in the shower so I wasn't washing my hair in the tub, but this is the products that I'm using. It's the Tresemme uh, Professional uh, Shampoo. And then I've also the, got the same range of the um, conditioner as well. So those are the two products that I'm using are uh, two Tresemme. They are a brand of Tresemme and yeah, I'm going to be washing it in the shower and I'm going to get you eyes. So I have washed my hair completely. This is how it looks. I'm really, really loving this hair red. Love a bit of texture. Sorry, not a bit of texture. I love a bit of color on my natural hair. Um, yeah, you might have seen also on my other old pictures where I had my natural hair. Um, I like color. Even on relaxed hair, it has to have color. And then here, I'm using the products just to put some moisture and shine on my hair. So I'm using the Tresemme. It's the heat protectant. I'm not blow drying my hair. I don't know why. Why is it? I'm just putting a bit of more water in there because um, the the heat protectant it has a bit of um, hydrating in there. And then I'm using the dark and lovely um, 
moisturizer as well so that's just to moisture my hair and put a bit of shine and not make my hair to be dry because I have stripped it a bit because of the dye the dye has chemical like I said guys so yeah this is how my whole process looks of coloring my hair and I'm very very excited with this new journey of being natural so I decided to also do a side part um, I didn't cut my hair I just opened up a line so it can be just a bit of cuteness yana just edgy yana <laughs> but I'm loving this so I'm really excited with my new natural journey new natural hair journey I'm all about it <laughs> So yeah guys, if you liked this, please don't forget to hit the notification bell of subscribing and please hit the button and subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification bell so you get a notification for whenever I post and please also leave a comment down below on the parts that you liked and I would like to hear from you. So. From my heart to yours, I hope you have a splendid Sunday. Or am I going to be posting it on Sunday? We'll see. <laughs> so yeah, guys, bye for now. Out of there as soon as possible. I we sat done. down in Mrs. Claire's okay. previous seat. I'm he told good. his men to remove the empty coffee cup.